Imagine yourself laughing at the worst possible moment. Maybe it's bad news, or maybe it's a serious conversation. Or you can imagine that one friend or family member laughing hysterically on the outside when in reality, they're nervous or scared on the inside. My name's Leo, licensed mental health counselor, checking in from the scenic landscape of Mont Royal as we continue to venture across Montreal, Ontario, Canada. And I'll have you know that this displaced reaction has a name. In the world of counseling, we sometimes call this an incongruent affect. This is what we show when what shows up on the outside doesn't quite match what you feel on the inside. Some describe laughter as being able to work like a pressure valve. Under stress, the body sometimes releases tension through a laugh instead of tears or silence. But here's where it gets interesting. Brain scans show laughter recruits the same emotion and control circuits in the limbic system that handle fear and inhibition. Some neurologists suggest that this overlap can flip stress into a laugh. Others also describe an appeasement-type display that can lower social threat and how nervous laughter often rides along with those cues. One person calls it an evolutionary false alarm system, a way to signal the threat isn't as bad as it feels. So, laughing when you're nervous? We all know someone who does it. It's your brain's way of discharging tension, reducing pressure, and keeping you going in the present moment. Save this and share it with someone in your friend group who'd be pleased to learn this about themselves. Like and comment and subscribe to my channel for more evidence-based mental health content. And take this with you to therapy.